Hello, we're on the train and it's Dave, who's never in my videos. Never, never. And then here is Chris, Chris is about to look very pretty. <laughs> and then you remember Katie. Hi. Yay, and then this is Rachel. <sighs> With the best water bottle ever. I can't worry. <laughs> there we go, amazing, lovely. And yes, we are We are now headed down to Cornwall for Herzl. That was, that was my script that just landed on the floor. <laughs> and we brought just a small amount of food with us, as you can see. Um, I understand this is only a selection of what we've got. Oh, there we go. We're off, folks. We're on our way. We have arrived at Senna and we're talking about packing. This is my case and I like to think I pack fairly well. This is Katie's case. So for scale, that's Katie's and that's mine. <laughs> you can see the difference. Now Katie's just going to talk you through her packing now. So it's taken years of perfecting but I feel like I've got it down to a T and I use this side for all the big stuff. So like jumpers, so I've got jumper, hoodie, I've got thin hoodie, shirt, leggings, comfy trousers, jeans. So that's like all the bulky stuff in this bit. And, and it's all packed flat. You can just never see it. Oh, oh, oh. So, so you can amazing. kind of squish it and then you get the zip zip done yeah. then this side is basically everything else but have also got floaty trousers shorts all my tops bras vests t-shirts hair dryers straighteners um charger for the toothbrush <laughs> pajamas i've got my pajamas. so um, much stuff swimming costume. don't know how you do um, it yeah it's, it's all in there it's i think incredible. it's incredible yeah i think it's the it could be the flat packing i'm not sure i tend to scrunch and roll everything so but yeah this is this is Pretty amazing. There we go. We're very impressed. <laughs> we are now in rehearsals for The Tempest. And we've had a really good productive day today. So we've done a table read, sit around the table, read the script, generally discuss it. And we've also built up our staging so that our, um, our set designers can create a marvellous set for us of Prosperous Island while we're in rehearsals. The reason I keep having to look down is I'm, I'm walking through this rather steep and windy path. Uh, that takes me down sort of across the cliffs so I can get home. It's a rather pleasant way to walk home. Uh, the view is rather lovely. In fact, I'll insert a couple of pictures here so you can see. Look at that. Just, ah, uh, I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous. As we live together in rehearsals, we take it in turns to cook for each other. And the person that went first was Rachel with this incredible toad in the hole. Mmm, nom 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 nom. <laughs> the chef. Amazing. Good morning everybody. So we've started blocking and my part's going to be really physical. So I am going to do a bit more exercise in rehearsals, which means I'm going to do the long walk, which means I get to go all the way down here to the beach and up every morning as part of my exercise for the role. And we're also going to be doing some yoga and lots of other things just to try and get myself physically fit and ready. So it's kind of like an aerial boot camp. Well, it's quite a steep climb to get up here. It's so worth it. There we go. Don't know if you can see from there. There's lovely markings on the floor. That's so our stage. We've marked out our stage so we can rehearse here. And just underneath me is the lovely Rachel. Good morning, lovely Rachel. Good morning. Everybody. Well, it is another day in paradise here. I don't know if you can see, the sea behind me is just so incredibly blue and it looks absolutely stunning here as always. Uh, so today's a day off. So what I'm gonna be doing is I've come down to the beach to do some yoga as part of my aerial boot camp. Then when I've done that, I'm gonna go and hire a board and a wetsuit and go surfing for a little while. And I think David's gonna come along and join me then. So that should be great. And then there'll be sort of line learning to do, going over blocking songs, all that kind of thing. 
so yeah, should be a good day, a busy day, but <laughs> look at the weather, it, just, it couldn't be better. Not actually got a huge lot left to learn now. I'm in act five in the very last scene of the play, just making sure I've got all these lines in my head. And this is the view while I do that. Hello everybody, so it's much later in the day. I think it's about six o'clock now and I've just had my very first juggling lesson because I um, might be juggling in this show so I've got to try and learn. I've got about a week and a half in which to learn this new skill. I didn't video my first lesson because I thought I should probably concentrate and wasn't really going to be good enough to be on camera yet. Um, but hopefully I will pick that up over the next week and then I'll be able to give you a little video of me juggling. videos I've shown have been Cornwall being its absolutely gorgeous, wonderful, beautiful, stunning self. Uh, but today it's been very windy and you can barely see the sea over there today. So I thought for a little bit of balance I'd show you what Cornwall's like when it's not gorgeously sunny. Because I know sometimes some of these videos can be like just showing all of the best bits um, and I don't want to do just that.